welcome back to my channel. My name is Nina and today I'm gonna be doing something that I have been avoiding for years. If you have been watching my videos, you probably noticed that my ends are so, they're so bad. I mean, they definitely need to be cut. That is because I have never trimmed my ends since I'm natural. <laughs> Four years of being natural, Four years without cutting my hair. Length over heel. I know. My bad. But today we're fixing that. This is a new beginning, guys. No more length over heel, I promise. I know it's gonna be so hard for me because this is the first time in my entire life I have my hair this long. I've never seen my hair as long as it is right now. But I'm sure she's gonna grow back. You're not gonna see me trimming my hair because this is more importantly, this is more than a trim. I'm gonna be cutting my hair. But Fina, this hair will grow back. You know how to do this. It's definitely time for a cut. And I'm sure it's gonna be worth it. Let's get started. Before I start cutting the hair, I want to share with you guys the reason why my hair is damaged. My natural hair journey started super basic four years ago. I started using wigs and I really enjoy myself using wigs and extension. But one year and a half later, I started liking my hair just like it is in its afro state. And then I started making mistakes. <laughs> In my first year of being natural, I got a silk press on a beauty salon. And yeah, I got heat damage. Half of the length of my hair didn't revert. And only six or seven months later, I visited another beauty salon and the problem, of course, got worse. <laughs> Instead of cutting this damaged hair, I started to apply all type of remedies found on the internet, try homemade and commercial products. I tried everything, trying to repair my hair from heat damage, but everything was useless. Cause when your hair is heat damaged, girl, all you can do for hair is cut it off. These products can help a little bit to dissimulate the bad appearance of your hair, but it's not the solution at all. I didn't want another big shop, so I focused on growing my fursy hair faster and longer and then cut those ends. Guys, you can tell we have done an incredible good job growing the hair faster. My hair usually grows so slow, but thanks to natural remedies and the 30 days challenges, look how long the hair is at this point. And in my entire life, this is the first time I have my hair this long. I am so happy about it, but it's not healthy. Here you can see how bad the ends are. Split ends, a bunch of single strand knots, the hair is not even, wow, it's so bad. Do you all can see how it's real thick here and how thin are the ends? Well, this all needs to go. I've been holding on to this, but not anymore. I'm cutting it all off and I'm gonna feel great about it. I'm so ready to start my healthy hair journey and for that, I need to cut a decent amount of hair off. Um, I'm gonna be cutting my own hair. Of course, the only person I trust my hair to cut it, it's me, okay? Stylish around me ruin my hair and I'm not gonna give them my money and the pleasure to cut the hair they ruin. No, thank you. I'm gonna be cutting my own hair. I know I'm not a professional, but I definitely know how to trip my hair. I definitely know what is the diamond hair I have to cut. And I definitely know I'm not gonna ruin my hair. As you can see, I blew out my hair to be more precise cutting it. But then I changed my mind. You know, I'm transitioning from severe heat damage and I think the best way to cut the heat damage hair is with wet hair. That way I can see clear the line of demarcation which is the line between both textures, the damaged hair and the healthy hair. So I'm gonna start by dividing the hair into medium sizes and detangle every section with conditioner. 
When I'm done with all sections, I'm gonna rinse out the conditioner and apply a styling cream and a mix of vegetable oils to keep the hair soft and manageable as I cut. Okay, we're ready, so let's take the scissors and start cutting. Here you can see the difference between the afro hair and the curly hair. So I'm gonna be cutting to where the afro hair begins. No bad. Wow, what a change in appearance and feeling. It feels amazing. Wow, I can't believe I kept it like that until now. Let's continue. Every time I finish a section, I will braid it out to avoid unnecessary tangles. Look at this section. Oh my god, <laughs> there's a lot here to cut. That hurts. <laughs> It feels really good, guys. Look how full my hair looks. I'm loving it. <laughs> Let's continue with the other sections. You better get prepared, guys, to the challenges we'll have to make to recover the hair we've gotten today, which is a lot. Because I'm loving how the hair is looking after cutting it. But you know, I want those inches back. <laughs> of course, I want those inches back. Look at this. Oh, please. A lot of hair to cut. For those who are new to the channel, in a 30 days hair growth challenge, we take a natural ingredient and taste it for 30 days consecutive, thus doubling and tripling our hair growth in a single month. Of course, there are ingredients that work super well and others that don't. But even so, we have managed to grow our hair very quickly with these challenges. So make sure you subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss any other challenge that's gonna help you grow your hair faster. You see, here is where I had to cut. That's a lot. <laughs> Goodbye, that ends. I'm in love, okay? I am in love. It, it feels so much better. I don't remember the last time I felt my hair like it feels right now. It feels way better, so much better. <laughs> Trust me, I really can feel the health sensation of my hair in my hands. Why I didn't do this before? What I was waiting for? <laughs> this is the very first time I feel my hair like this. As I said, I got hit that much in the first year of being natural. And before that, I used to wear wigs. So I never enjoyed my hair like I was supposed to. Look how clear you can see the difference between that much and healthy hair. All this hair has to go. Look at that. I'm gonna go ahead and take down this braid because I'm gonna be using this strand to cut the section next to it and make sure they're all at the same length. Okay, I think we've done a good job. This is all the ends gone. That is a lot, guys. <laughs> but we know the formula to make our hair grow faster and longer. This is not a secret. Natural remedies for 30 days and we're gonna grow this hair back very soon. Wow, I can't believe this is my hair. This is another level, guys. I'm super happy with the results. My hair feels so soft from root to ends, she feels fuller. This is definitely a new beginning, health over length from now and on. And yeah, I'm so ready to start enjoying my new hair. Well guys, this is it for today's video. I hope you like it. Subscribe to the channel. Don't miss out the results of the 30 days hair growth challenges of this year. Love you all and see you guys in my next one. Bye.